Hi, I'm Kathy Friedrich, and welcome to High Step Circuit, a fun and challenging workout designed for the beginner to intermediate exerciser that will help you burn body fat and shape and tone your muscles. This workout features the high step, which not only easily adjusts to add exercise variety and intensity to your workout, but also effectively targets the legs and glutes, which will help lift, firm, and reshape these areas. The high step is unique in that you will lower your step height while performing step aerobics and increase your step height to a level of your own comfort while doing other total body conditioning exercises. I have designed a special format for this workout. It consists of six fitness cycles that combine easy to learn step aerobics along with effective weight training exercises not only to maximize the benefits of your high step but to your overall fitness program. Light hand weights and resistance tubing will also be used to enhance your workout experience. Well, enough talking. Put on your exercise shoes, grab a bottle of water, and let's get to it. All right, let's warm up. Side step right here, side to side. Chest nice and tall, arms opening up to the side. You want to use full range of motion. Get those body parts all warmed up, ready to go. And a power three. It's a repeater with a little lift on it. Good, basic, up and down. And two step hop, lift, alternate leg extension, lift and sweep. And a power three, push up. You're gonna come up and go a little bit deeper and feel that glute pull into it a little more. Squeeze, and again. We're gonna do just a couple more reps. How about we do four more, let's do it. Four, and lift. Three, then the band work here. Push up again, up and down. Keep the form, arms just slightly in front and down. Exhale, last two, looking at the television. Keep that head in neutral, alignment with the spine. How we doing? Woo! All right, last two. And in, last one. Starting all over, repeater, low impact. And run up with two claps. Watch where you're going. And up, up, tap off. Great job, do it again. Alternate the knee with a lift. You don't have to put the lifts in if you don't want. Repeater, pull, down, up, and back. Now let's transition, step down slow, and go back on top. Now to this side, remember to follow CD if the knee lift is a little bit too much for you by putting your foot on the step between the transitions. And again, down, up, come on, work. Pull it up, you got it, again. Whew. Notice our legs are a little further apart here. That helps to get that inner thigh muscle work in. Pull and up, lift, how we doing? You always have the option to put down the tubing if you prefer to do it without any equipment at all. That's always a nice option too. Trust me, you will still feel it. With your toes up to help you with your balance. Side to side we go. Woohoo! Targeting those oblique muscles down the side. Do you feel them working? Knee other side, rock press, push off the back. Step hop corner to corner, lift, yes. Step knee, touch behind. Knee, other side. Knee, touch behind. Knee, other side. Rock press, push off the back. Down, keep going. Step, knee, down. Excellent. All right, we got one more here. And up. Now you don't want the back knee to touch the floor. Do it again. And down. Keep going, concentrate. Woo! All right, three, one more time. And lift. All right, other side, pulse up, let's go. Up. Two, arm no higher than shoulder height. But I know you know that this time, because I've already told you, right? No plane, head is the highest point, heels are the lowest. How's that feeling for you? Channeling in there, really working the deep muscles of the abdominal area. Lift. Knee off the back, repeater on this corner. Notice this one's low intensity, and this one we're gonna add a little jump to it, and that's your option. Good, knee off the side, over twice, over again. Kick, how many more? 
All right, we're working. You got four more to go. Four and three, two, three. How we doing? Down, two, three, and up. You can do this. Come on, pull. Okay. Up and down. If you want to make this harder, guess what you can do? You can step wider on your band when you start it out. Okay, that will make it so that you're pulling up with a harder tension. Now legs are up, up and down. Work it hard. As the legs come up, you'll notice that a little bit more of the lower abdominal gets in there. Front, back, good, go off the side. Lift, side kick. You're looking good, you had some practice, huh? And kick, karate kick. Woo, is this the last one? Do it again. Up and down. Lift. Pull to the top. Come on. Three to go. Now let's go back to the deadlift. Down two counts, getting the hamstrings in the lower back. Now your dead row right here, getting the upper back along with it. Down for two, all the way down. And lift. Dead row, in, pull back, out and down, two, and down, three, four, do that again, lift, two, you're gonna build up endurance to keep this going, four more, four, so it might be hard now, but each and every time you'll get further with it, all right, now, oh, they're wanting another one, how about you at home, all right, uneven, circle, this one's for the guys behind me here, down, and single, push, two, pull it again, seven more, two, three, come on, work it right to the end. You still have the other leg, let's go. Oh yes, now if this is too much of a challenge and you're not ready for it, do this on a lower step height. Other, and lift, come on, work it, and up. Keep that going, down and up. Three, last two. Coming on this side, so I don't know if you're happy or sad right now. And lift. Keep going, work it hard. And exhale, come on, you've got eight to go. Keep it going. Last four. Three, two. Let's stretch now, take a nice deep breath, inhale. And exhale, let it out. Again, a nice deep breath, inhale. And exhale. Take a deep breath, inhale. Exhale, one more big one up. And exhale, you did a fantastic job. We will see you next workout.